Hi everybody, I'm at Warm Sands Village today. And you may ask, what took me so long to get here? <laughs> I've only just found out about this mod, thank you Crisco Bingo. It's a beautiful place. It adds a little Khajiit village to your world. I'll show you where it is. In the beautiful rift, Warm Sands Village, near to Mistwatch, Shore's Stone. You can fast travel here straight away and it does have a player home too. Oh no, my goat died. Good morning. We had a dragon attack. Thank you for working on my garden. <laughs> That's very sweet. This is actually your house. Need something? Moonlight farm, but I'll just show you around the rest of the village first. This one needs something. Want anything. Naturally, there's a, a clean mug around here somewhere. Thank you, thank you. There's a pub, and there are some sweet bits of decoration. The village is full of people. It feels lively. Ooh, check that out. Alto wine, mead with juniper berry. Nice. Somewhere for the people to sleep. And there are cottages. Oh, hi. Hmm? Take a look. Okay, he sells a bit of everything. Until next time. Keeping your eye on me, aren't you? This one needs something? No. So that's a hit. I really like this place. And there are little kitties. Little kitten children. Hi there. Hi there. Oh, did you need something? And a tailor shop. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. If not, let need something? Take a look. And again, all sorts of things. So this is a really useful village, as well as being Until next time. a lovely addition to your landscape. Oh, I love the balls of wool. And the flower pots. My, don't look at my fireplaces, they're still broken. And there's a full smithy, wood chopping blocks. There's a guest house where your followers can sleep. enough <laughs> nice decoration you can see that there's been a lot of thought put into this Oh yeah, we had a dragon and a bear attack. <laughs> Everyone came out to look. Hi there. Hi there. Mr. Dragonfly is having a good time at the moment. He enjoys traveling with us very much. <laughs> That's terrific. As soon as we got here, the first thing that Inigo said was, I love it here. As well he might, because this is your home. So you have a smashing kitchen with an oven, a cooking pot, and a butter churn. All this lovely decoration. Lots of stores. A few weapon racks by the door. That 
is a big fir tree. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm not sure it's supposed to be that big. I think my uh, better vanilla trees has probably had an effect on that. So you have an alchemy lab and an enchanter. Bookcase. All this pretty decoration over here. And then downstairs. Fair few fertile soils indoor as well as out. Display case. And I feel like Look at this. I mean, this is just awesome. The tiny little brooms being used as paintbrushes. <laughs> oh, I feel like this home gives me something, some interests. You know what I mean? I mean, look, I'm an artist. I'm I'm an indoor gardener. <laughs> I, I really I enjoy that. And here's your room. So you can just lie on the bed if you want to, rather than sleeping on it. Just chill out. And you're bunked up with your kids. Which is just perfect, isn't it? Because you would, wouldn't you? As the mother of a litter. Or, you know, father. In my case. So, room for four kids in here. And it's a gorgeous room. Lovely bits of artwork. Beautiful fireplace. Shrine to Nocturnal and a Change Your Appearance mirror. Storage. So I think this place is really charming. That's a lot to recommend it. Apart from being a useful place to have in your landscape, it's also really attractive. Okay, so as you can see, everybody gathers around, you've got people to talk to, trade with. I just love it. I'm going to leave you with that view. Um, if you like the look of this, do download it and fully explore. There are other buildings that I didn't go into that you can have a look at. Uh, more vendors uh, and more people to talk to. I'll call that the end of this one. Thank you so much for watching, for your comments and for subscribing. Uh, I always love to read what you've got to say, so I hope you've enjoyed this one and I will see you soon for the next. <laughs>